When I was a boy many years ago, one of the most common dishes on menus, one of the most popular with the customers, was a beef stroganoff. It should take between five to 10 minutes, depending on the size of your meat, and secondly, the quantities that you're making. What is it? Butter, onions, paprika, butter mushrooms, tomato puree, olive oil, a fillet of beef, sour cream, nor beef stock pot, okay, lemon juice, and parsley. A little butter. So in this pan, I'll make my sauce, and this, I'll cook my beef. In with the onions, little paprika. When you cook paprika, you have to be very careful because a lot of people, what they tend to do is season their beef with the paprika, and when they fry their beef, they tend to burn it. Cook it very gently with your onions. You'll get a much better result. We take our mushrooms. As you can see, the mushrooms that I'm using are very small and very white, very important. If you go for large brown mushrooms, it tends to stain your sauce. In the pan with the onions and the paprika, in with the beef. The best cut of meat to use, in my opinion, is fillet steak, every time. But if you can't get fillet, then use rum or use sirloin. Just sweat down your mushrooms with the onions and the paprika, and you can see that the mushrooms are starting to be stained by the paprika, which gives it that very attractive color. Add the tomato puree. So you can see that I don't shake the pan, I move the meat. By shaking the pan, you lose heat. And you know, this way, you can see the caramelization in your meat. Lots of people cut it into strips, so therefore you don't get that caramelization. I like a big chunk of my fillet steak, so I get that nice caramelization, but my meat's pink inside. Then we add our sour cream into the colander with our meat. Two things, one, releases the fat, which has been cooked in, and secondly, it starts to rest the meat. Allow the juices to drip out. And add one more beef stock pot. The stock pot, as you can see, is used as a seasoning, but it also gives it great body, and it gives it that beefiness, which you want. And then we finish with a little lemon. As you can see, my meat's rested. It's still hot. Add your beef. And there you have it, beef stroganoff in 10 minutes from start to finish. I would recommend that you serve it with rice, which is traditional and classical, or with ribbons of pasta. And to finish, a little parsley. And there's our beef stroganoff. And what the Nor Beef Stock Pot does is gives it that real depth of flavor. It gives it real body, which makes a massive difference.